Today we are discussing different types of fishing line. Which fishing line you choose really depends on your fishing situation and your personal preference. The first line I'll discuss is braid. Braid is a relatively new development in the last 20 years and anglers really like it because it allows for a further casting distance. It also has low stretch. But some of the downsides to braid are that it's not clear so it has higher visibility in the water. And also knots tend to slip when using braid so certain knots such as a uni knot or a palomar knot should be used. Another downside to braid is it can be a little bit more expensive than some other line types. The next line I'll go over is monofilament. Monofilament is a very popular line type and it's been around for a long time. The great thing about monofilament is it's relatively inexpensive and it's clear so it has low visibility in the water. But it does stretch out over time and when left in the sun it does degrade because of UV light. A good thing about monofilament though is that it can be recycled. And the final line type I'm going to speak about today is fluorocarbon. Fluorocarbon works great as a leader material. And the reason why is because it's super clear. And it also holds up really well to abrasion and UV light. If you're gonna be fishing for species that have sharp teeth or anywhere near structure, fluorocarbon would be a good choice for a leader. The downside to fluorocarbon though is that it's very stiff and it can be tough to tie knots with it and also it tends to be a very expensive line type. 